Hey guys, hope you're well and welcome to this showcase video. I have a real treat for you today. We've got this really cool Fire Slayers Warband. Uh, really cool selection of models. Now, if you're new to the Siege Studios YouTube channel, then firstly, welcome. Here at Siege Studios, we are a UK-based premium commission miniature painting studio with 28 painters who all paint from our bronze introductory above tabletop minimum standard all the way up to platinum, which is our competition entry quality. Uh, if you are interested in a quote, then very simply, all you need to do is head to the description of this video where it says get a quote. Click on that link. It takes you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact form whereby you need to select the relevant drop down options from those available on the contact form for you and your projects. And in the message section, include a list of models in our model list format. Once it's been sent off to us, we'll come back to you with a quote and get the process started. We're back in a second to have a look at these fire slayers in more detail. See you guys back in a sec. So let's jump in, have a look at these awesome four fire slayers. Pretty much every single one is a character with the amount of detail, their individuality of pose as well. There's lots of lots going on with every model. Uh, they've been worked on by Keith, one of the artists here at Siege, uh, who I know he had a really stellar time working on this small commission. Let's dive in, have a look at these models in more detail. Really, really cool sculpts on them uh, with all the extra little details that you'd expect. Uh, so much time and attention has gone into the skin tones across the models, uh, all the different bits and bobs of detail on the armor, the loincloths, all those different things have all been done and had a lot of time spent on them as well, which is really, really lovely. Lots of stages are highlighting on all of these as well. This guy looks very defensive, as you can see, uh, with his double axe as well, which is really, really cool. Uh, so that's just the first of the four from this warband. We then have uh, this charging guy here, really, really cool. As you can see again, they're about to cleave someone with the, the, re the re reverse axe as well, which is really lovely. Looks like he's about to swing it and uh, make someone's day very, very unfortunate. But again, you can see the lovely subtle areas of contrast and transitions that have been put into the skin as well uh, to really make him very lifelike. Uh, massive beard on him there, as you can see, with various stages of highlighting on that hair as well, which is lovely. All the gold work has got various areas of detail work all done in it as well, with little intricate bits just picking out certain aspects of it which is lovely do specifically love the bases as well with the little skulls on them as well which is really cool so that's just the, the second guy from the uh, warband pull forward the rear guy here Again, huge, huge axe there. You can see a little bit of chipping and scratching that's been done on the blade. Uh, but again, all these little details, eyes and teeth and everything fully painted. Uh, lovely, lovely warm skin tone on these as well, which is really cool. But again, the same attention to detail all the way through. Every little bit of gold work fully picked out and highlighted to a very, very nice set of standards, which is really, really cool. So that's just this awesome fire slayer. And then the final dude that I really, really like uh, is got this huge, totally relaxed pose. The rest of them all look ready for war, but this guy is just... Uh, just chilling on a ginormous skull, set of keys in his hand, a huge axe just resting on his shoulders. But again, you can see all the little details on him fully as well, which is really, really lovely. Um, again, the skin tone done to a very, very nice standard uh, and all the areas of detail throughout, fully highlighted through multiple stages and picked out. Lovely complimentary red ruby-ish kind of uh, loincloths on them as well, which is really, really nice. Again, really super vibrant hair as well, which just complements the rest of it very nicely as well. And uh, this huge skull on the base here as well. But overall, a lovely, lovely project for us to work on here at Siege. Uh, these are all finished up now. I know Keith had a great time, as I said, and uh, they're going to be going to their clients. We're back in a second to have a look at them in again very quickly and go over how you can take out a project with us here at Siege. See you guys back shortly. So there we have it guys, this awesome Fire Slayers warband. I know Keith had a phenomenal time working on these four awesome little character models. Really, really cool project, loads of detail on them and I know he had a good time. If you are interested in a warband, character, small force or vast army, then all you need to do very simply to get a quote from us here at Siege is head to the description of this video where it says get a quote. Click on that link, it takes you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact form and once you're there, select the relevant drop down options from those that are available for your project and in the message section include a list of models in our model list format fire that form off to us to hear back from us with a quote for your project uh, and get the process started while you're here on youtube do us a huge favor a couple of things obviously give the video a thumbs up that would help us massively subscribe to the channel and then hit the bell icon because you will be then notified of all the uploads that happen on our channel and also while in while you're in the description of the video what you can do is follow us or you know go look on facebook instagram or twitter as we have accounts on all of those uh, you can like and uh, follow us respectively on all of those and keep up to date with all the other things that we do here at siege Thank you for watching the video from the, all the team and myself. I really appreciate it and I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.